Cipolla came firing in. The Flames had a little bit of an error. There's another shot on goal. Two shots already in this period as it's still young. Up ice, here comes Fussy. Oh, golden opportunity. Tries to dump it on in, fires, goal! First shot, first goal of the season for the Flames. To put him up on the board, one nothing. You know, I was just about to say, there you go, what a start to the period for the Washington Pride. Two tremendous looks, had a three on zero at one point and almost converted that. But ultimately, I mean, what a shot by Carly Glover, the freshman, getting the first goal of the season for the Flames and set up beautifully on the assist. one nothing Flames, and just like that, the puck's in the back of the net. Along the blue line is now that gets shoved on in deep. And fresh line for the Flames. And it goes in. Atomic was not expecting it. I believe that was Sasha Adamic able to knock it in. So this pass here, if we see it on the replay, this shot was not destined to go to goal. This shot was destined to go to the stick of Sasha Adnek. And not only was it a great pass, but it was a great touch. See how she goes to the stick, right? Like that puck's never gonna make it to the net. So Advic's there, There's it's just her and the keeper face off when they're down a woman and immediately goes on the offensive. I mean, we've kind of seen this in this game. That's been a big theme. Oh, there goes it, shoots oh. in, in through the five hole. Not what Liberty wanted is Mariah Ralph, the captain of Washington, puts him on the board. You want to talk about a fortunate bounce if you are the Washington Pride. This was set up by Lexi Sung making a great great shot to the center ice, right? And then Maria Ralph, as she's done so often, 26 goals, 26 assists last season. Here's the shot, and Sung gets the centering pass, and Ralph, as she's skating away, right? She's skating away from the net, still gets the stick in right through the five hole. Washington's back in the game. All of a sudden, this game just got a whole lot more interesting as we just reached 13 minutes left in the third period. Another good stick from Grace Romeo, who we called her name a lot tonight between her sticking away some passes and having a lot of good looks. Now the Flames in their defensive zone. Going down, laying the hit was Wildeberger. That's another shot and score. All of a sudden this game has turned upside down for the Flames. And what did we see on that last play that led to the goal? We saw a hit. We saw the first hit of the game. I mean, and that all set up and who we just talking about 30 seconds ago, Grace Romeo. She has been a factor, right? She's been a huge factor in, in this comeback. There's the hit right Play there. The wood. Set up by Grace Wildeberger, and there you go. I mean, just like that, down to nothing. Backs to the wall, here we go. I mean, brand new ball game, eight minutes to go. I mean, who could have expected this? Regather it, and Demerta puts on the brakes. Waiting for a couple teammates. Sends it on over to Fussy. Uh, Fussy. Lasering shot. Opportunity and it is in. Breaking the tie. It's Carly Glover, second goal on the game. All of a sudden, it's three to two flames. Yep, and I mean, once again, a tremendous save by Adamuk. She's had a number of those all game. But this time, this time, Carly Glover is right there does not hesitate, does not panic, easily puts in the back of the net. Carly Glover for me, I'm gonna say it now, player of the game. That's no question about it. Glover, a nice little backhand shot. She's gotten the first goal and the third goal. She's by far been the difference maker in this game to keep the Flames afloat. As that comes skating on out into their zone and that will end the third period of action. Liberty able to hang on after a little bit of a scare as they're able to beat Washington 3-2 in Liberty's season opener to start their campaign for a fourth national title in a row. Absolutely. I think Chris Lowe's is going to look at a few things. That last three minutes, I think, was key in giving them that victory between the penalty kill, between 
Washington never took their goalie out. Why? Because they were always on the defensive, allowed Liberty to get a few good shots, stay on their offensive the whole time, propelled them to the win. Nice win for the Flames. Let's see if they play better as the season progresses. We have another game tomorrow as Washington and Liberty will play. They'll play tomorrow at 10.30 a.m. right here at the LIC. Carly Glover, the star of the game, the sophomore transfer this week, had the first goal and the most important final goal to win. Absolutely. Carly Glover making her presence felt in Liberty only a week after she transferred. 3-2. to two, Lots of stuff to talk about. It'll be a great game tomorrow. Make sure to tune in tomorrow for that at 10.30 a.m. For Joey Palermo and TJ Wilkerson and the entire crew, I'm David Hoffman saying so long from LaHaye Ice Center.